hi i'm sudhir in this video i'm going to explain about five basic methods present in console class they are write write line read read line and read key so let's start with write method so if you want to print some message on the output screen we are going to use this write method so in this example i want to print hi message on the output screen for this console or write of hi is the line of code i'm going to use okay i'm going to execute this in the output screen you can see hi will be printed the cursor will be in the same line because we have used a method called write there but by default every console application is going to get closed after printing the after printing some message on the output screen if you want to see the message printed on the output screen you have to use a method called read key so that the output screen is going to wait till you press a key now we can see that hi is printed and the cursor will be in the same line and till you press a key it's going to stay because we have written console.read key there so this is the use of write method and read key method we also have one more method to print message on output screen that is console.write line i'm going to comment this first line i'm going to write console dot write line of hi this time the same hi message is printed on the output screen but the cursor will be in the next line because we are using a method called write line here so you can see that hi is printed on the first line and the cursor will be moved onto the next line so that is the use of write line where we control the cursor it will be in the next line we also have two more methods called read and read line so read and read line are two methods used to take input from the user so first i am going to explain about console dot read so i am going to use read method to take input from the user and the return type of read method is int that is why i have created variable called i of int data type which is going to store the value taken from read method cw is what you have to write and press tab t two times so that console dot write line will be there on your visual studio now i am going to print the value inside i using this line of code so i am going to execute it so you can see that it is expecting some value because we have used a line of code called console dot read it's going to take a it's going to convert into number here because the return type is int so it's going to convert that character into number and you can see the ascii value of a there 97 is printed and it will be in the next line so that is how read is used to take input but it converts automatically to number that was the problem with that so because its return type is int now i'm going to comment it control plus k plus c is shortcut for comments next we have read line read line is also a method used to take value from the user whereas the return type of that is string so i'm going to take a string variable called s to save the value console dot read line so read line is going to take value from the user and it is going to save into s so as it is of string type there is no conversion here everything what are the user is going to give it will be into s and we can use that for our operations so here in this output it is going to expect some value using read line i'm going to give a there and I press on enter it is a it is a as it is because there is no conversion there because the return type is string and you can also enter more than one value with read line because we are it is return type is string so once again i'm going to execute it and i'm going to enter multiple characters there like a b c and it is saved in s and the, we are printing the value inside s so this is how read line and read is used to take input with re different return types whereas write and write line is used to print some message on output screen so write and read methods are having cursor in the same line write line and read line will have cursor in the new lines whereas read key helps you to see the output without closing immediately so that's it this is about the five methods thank you